Hey guys, how you doing? This is a nuclear cyborg mat. I want to be narrating from the background so uh, I can uh, show you around more. But there, here I am. Uh, I'm back from my first day at uh, <clears throat> Walt Disney World in Orlando, Florida. We went to Hollywood Studios today and I'm telling you, man, it was awesome. So awesome. Uh, I was able to get get there uh, in the morning. Uh, I, I made two I made two blunders. I uh, or a blunder. I uh, I brought my pocket knife in, uh, into my bag, and uh, when they checked it in security, they uh, said they uh, can't bring my knife. I'd take it back to the truck. But anyway, it was uh, that wasted time. We were there. We were going to get through security like 10 to 15 minutes before the park opened, and I had to run back and then go through security again. And yeah, it was a waste of time. And they really upped security. I'm telling you, man, they they take everything out of your bag. They take your time. They take time. like, I guess it's how they want to slow down the lines. But really, it's it's amazing. And then you have to go through a, a metal detector, too. It's, it's completely insane. Anyway, here I am, back in my room, back after the first day. I just took a shower. <clears throat> but anyway, I got there early this morning when we finally got into the park. But we beelined right for the... Uh, uh, Star Wars Galaxy's Edge, and really the crowds were not that bad. I uh, finally found my way into uh, <clears throat> uh, where you checked in for Savi's workshop uh, to build my lightsaber. And uh, uh, when I finally checked in, I picked the one that I wanted. They gave me my limited edition pen. Here, let me go get my pen and show it to you. Yeah, here it is, my limited edition pen. I chose Protection and Defense. Because, again, Mr. Yoda is one of my masters or, call, uh, what do you call it, uh, people I go to for advice, you know, stuff like that. I, uh, so what did he say? You know, a, a Jedi uses the Force for knowledge and defense, never for attack. So, protection, defense. Anyway, it's really cool. Uh, it was a really unique, unique and awesome experience. I, uh... It was so awesome because, one, I had my appointment for 6.25 at night. I was able to get in within 10 minutes in the morning. There was all, And it was, again, awesome because it was almost one-on-one. -on -one. The uh, There was only one other person in there with me, with somebody to uh, film the experience. Um, I filmed a little bit of it, not all of it. I couldn't film myself doing it because, you know, nobody was there. My buddy that came into the park with me had two daughters, and he went to go build a droid, and I'm telling you, he didn't leave. He couldn't leave be one of his daughters to do the recordings. But anyway, there's, I mean, that, that really does suck, and, you know, I'm trying, going to try to remember that. I wanted the video of me doing it so I could remember, but, you know, Anyway, moving on, I'm, uh, but I built the lightsaber, chose the purple crystal, and it worked perfectly, and it looks awesome, it really does, and then after that, I went into the uh, shop next door, the Doc Ondors, and I bought a whole bunch of crystals, which, uh, actually I don't have here, though, after coming to another video, I, uh, uh, gave them to my mom when she came back too early to the, uh, to, uh, uh, hotel. But uh, I was able to get six, uh, eight red crystals uh, with the, well, all of my party and no, and no black crystal. And actually, when I went back to see if I could get more from, an, from one other person so I would make ten, uh, they were actually sold out. And uh, I suspect they technically weren't sold out. They probably had more in the back, but then they're probably only allowed to bring out so many at front in the front per day uh, so that they don't keep running off the shelves but anyway i got all the colors except black um uh, i got like eight reds now but you know and then i bought a jedi, a jedi holocron and then i bought a uh a costume uh it's a bit it's a it's a large youth size it might be a bit big on me but you know i have this place at the where i live uh and i could go get it uh tailored if i need to Anyway, I just wanted to show you around. Um, I meant to do this last night, um, first night being here, but uh, we uh, 
went out to dinner and then after that we were just all tired so I didn't really get to do it but here is my room uh, let me see of course you don't know what a bathroom looks like there's the bathroom right there my sh there's the shower I brought my, I brought my own uh, shampoo and uh, um, body wash <clears throat> and then uh, what you said, here's the Outside, right outside, this is where I have all my stuff, and I uh, get ready in the morning. I didn't get ready this morning. I uh, slept in. <laughs> anyway, and then here's the bedroom. As you can see, there's all the stuff, too, that uh, I have in my magic band and whatnot. My necklace. There's my uh, towel and poncho, and here's the bed that I was using. As you can see, it's a mess already. And then uh, here's all my stuff laid out for tomorrow, my shoes. Anyway, what? And then stuff that I've accumulated up there. And then out the door there, yeah, I have it closed because, like I said, I just got out of the shower. There's the uh, living room uh, and the uh, kitchen area. Uh, anyway, I just passed the six minute mark, so I'm going to end this video. And uh, I, I got to put this phone back on the charger because uh, my battery that I told you I had to stop recording and uh, taking pictures today because I my battery ran out and I didn't bring my uh, external a battery pack into the park today so anyway <clears throat> that's all that i just want to make a quick video and uh there'll be more to come tomorrow's animal kingdom see you then